Good morning, guys. Happy day. It is Thursday already. I can't even believe that. It's quarter after 10. Girls are already done home school because Gabby woke up at the crack of dawn and was like, oh, if I start school now, I'll be done. And she's done. But we have a rule, no electronics till afternoon. And now she's doing her hair. No, because you said I have to. Yeah, I'll still be grounded. Right, and I say that every single day. Do your hair or you're going to be in trouble and it should never work. So today is a miracle. Every day holds the possibility of a miracle. I firmly believe that and today that is my miracle. These are my little miracles too. Right? One thing about homeschool kids is they have chores. I know uh, with my other kids and when the girls went to school that they never could do chores because they always had homework and there just was no time. They either had to um, play for a half an hour or do chores for half an hour and I you chose only, play. You only get a break from school one day a week. Because Sunday you're free all day but then you have homework at night. Yeah, when you go to school. But at homeschool, you're free a lot, huh? Yeah. Yeah, and, so and you still get the summer break. Yeah, they're really excited. They forgot from last year if they had the summer break off. They're like, do we get summer holidays? I'm like, yeah, we do. This mama needs a summer holiday. Anyway, we are getting chores done, getting ready for our day. We're headed back to the barn today. Who's gonna ride today? Move, move. Talk with your mouth full. Move, move. I'm riding. Whose lesson is it? Sophie's. Mine. Yeah, Sophie's Mine. lesson and Gabby will ride Storm yeah. too. So you guys saw that he did a little bit of jumping yesterday. Our friend Jesse at the barn um, tried jumping him a little bit and he did really well. I felt like he did really well. So hopefully um, that continues and he can go a little bit higher. Even just a little higher would be awesome for us. And I think that would last us for a while. Say hi, Ruby. Say hi, Ruby. Hi, Ruby. Hi, Ruby. Oh my gosh. Here is a Ruby update for you guys who haven't done one in a while. She is amazing with us. She does the funniest things now. At night, Sam and I edit. We both edit videos together. And we'll both be working away at our computers and editing. And it'll get later and later and later. And she gets to the point where she's like, oh, I want to go to bed. But she won't go to bed without us. So she'll come over to the computer and she'll sit beside Sam. She'll put her head in his lap. And if he still ignores her, she puts her head underneath his hand, pushes his hand up until he pays attention to her. And she's like, take me to bed. And he'll say, I can't go. Like, go to bed if you want to, but she won't. And if I try and cuddle her, she pulls away from me and it stands closer to Sam. It's just so funny. But she, yeah, she tells us when she wants to go to bed. Yes, and then she stands on the stairs and then dad's like, what do you want? And she runs upstairs and sleeps in the dog bed. Yeah, like she, she tries to tell us. She loves her bed. She loves her new bed, that's for sure. Too much, we need to move it down here. Yeah. Cause like, everyone will be downstairs and we'll start wondering where Ruby is and then she'll be upstairs in her bed. Yeah, she loves her bed and there she is having breakfast. She's like, don't talk about me. Yeah, that's what happens. They can climb you guys. All right, we are in the bunny pen, and I am cleaning it out. Do you like their blanket, their newest blanket? Oh. Yeah, it's mine. It is a horse blanket. Our bunnies are living with horses right now. <laughs> this is my boy. Isn't he cute now? <laughs> like, he's so cute. Yes, See how dark gray mine. his face is and his ears? <laughs> Wait, can I get him and rename him Hero? You want to name him, rename him Hero? Yeah, because he has a mask on. Look yeah. at his Yeah, he has a, a mask. mask. Oh, oh. Okay, and there's Daisy, and here are two of the bunnies, and the third one is hiding because they climb up. So that pen over there will have bars on it like this high one here. I just have to clean out his pen. But they can. But jump they climb it. Climb. They jump it. They climb it. I can't keep the bunnies in. I'm not gonna lie, you guys. The bunnies are too much for me. Like. Uh, I look at them and I love them and I watch them and they're amazing and I suck at them like I, I can't handle it the smell the constant cleaning like I saw all these videos and they had such amazing setups and they were like watch me clean my cage and when you when you watch the video literally the cage was like three quarters of the way clean and I didn't realize that until now like it's all fake you guys this is Crystal's guy who was climbing. So this is the bunny. She gave it away. Yeah, all these bunnies are going to a new home on Saturday. I didn't tell you. Are you okay with that? 
Yeah, we're like, get rid of the bunnies <laughs> because they're so crazy, huh? Yes, yeah. Crystal. Look at that yeah, chance. but Sophie does all the work and Gabby does all the work. <laughs> Look at Duchess. Yeah, you bunny. are cute. But you do. Look at those. Lots of work, too. Yeah, thanks, you Sophie. Do. Thanks for acknowledging my effort, but you guys take care of them day to day. I just take care of them every time I clean them. <laughs> but I'm loving him. Hey, like, he bunny poop. A gorgeous bunny. Like, come on, I just cleaned it and you already pooped. So we're gonna put this pen back together, clean this guy's pen. You guys remember him? That's Lucky. He's a what? Teacher. No, he's a baby. Two baby bunnies were in here last night. Yeah, like no, he's a baby the babies uh, jump through the bars, or they climb up and over, and they just go wherever they want. Like baby bunnies are the devil. I'm loving him. Like. Look I'm at it, honestly. Him. You want him back now? No yeah. tradesies. He is so gorgeous. Mom, you get lucky. <laughs> and he does have like a heart on his face, kind of. Mom. With a big nose in the middle. Hey, I'm, him, I'm right? renaming him to Hero. You want to rename my bunny? The hero, because he has a mask on. Gabby, do you want mom's bunny? You don't want Daisy? Mm -hmm. You want Daisy now? What about Lucky? Mm -hmm. Well, how about they just be all of our bunnies? Yeah. I'm gonna give this one huge extra shot. I'm gonna like honestly, I have anxiety about it to the point where I procrastinate to not have to come in here because it's so much work and it's just really hard. And if we can figure it out after the babies go and it gets better, then it's gonna be okay. But guys, I gotta tell ya, the permanency of our bunny situation is not yeah, so permanent. You can really, really, really praying oh about God, this to her. figure out what I want to do. Ruby's like, please just let me eat them. <laughs> she's so cute. She's like, oh, is that boy fixed? Cause I meet a boy that's not fixed. <laughs> Cause but all our boys are fixed. But Ruby's a girl. Yeah, but she doesn't know that. Don't you dare bunny. Don't you dare jump out of there. All right, it is much easier without the hay. I only got two small bags of garbage from the bunnies. That is a two small bags of garbage three times a week. So much work. Welcome to the barn and the new lake. Got a new lake at our barn. Ooh, a lake. Get out of there. Right. All right, come on, let's go down and get storm if you're gonna ride him. Walking up from the barn and Ben keeps going over to the side and eating any hay that he finds, eating the trees and Chloe's pulling them and then as he's leaning over to the side and he's trying to eat all the stuff and then there goes Storm walking by with his head hung low, walking by right beside Gabby all calm and nice and quiet. He's such a funny boy I think, really. He's too lazy to misbehave. Right, three horses. Jeez Louise, you look huge today. Get his tack out, please. Over the brown poles, please. Stretch your heels down and just one only on the pole and then back to rising. Rising a straight line. The hardest part when we're jumping when we're doing poles is to make our horse ride straight. Do you feel how she went up those poles in Vietnam? Yes. We're going to try it again. When you go over it, you're going to look at that little pole standing up on the wall. Straight line to that wooden pole, that single little pole. So two point over the pole. Okay, straight, straight, straight. Right leg. Gabby, 
You can do it. Turn. Oh yeah, there she goes. One and two and three and four. Good job. Yeah, there she goes. Yes, Getting ready to learn the jumping basics here. Yes, Look at turn. All right. Over the pool. Good job, so Good job. That was really well Good job, so.
away Another day of back stealing borrow And that is safe to say No, they don't pick us up Instead they knock us down And that's the way it goes Until we're in the ground I don't wanna do this anymore hey. No, I just wanna Right, that's a black one Okay. You ready for this storm? You will know you'll lose them if you rub down with them. Okay. You have to lift up. Oh. Ah, like, ah, <laughs> so. but you're gonna use it just like your foot. You're gonna forget you even have them. Because you'll notice where they are is just where you're gonna squeeze with your ankle. Okay, so Today, you, you can't hurt it. Wider? wider? Is it tight too tight? Yes. Good luck. Good luck, buddy. Yeah. Is that better? Good. He's okay. used to being ridden with, he was trained with stirrups, so, or with spurs. This horse was trained from the very beginning with spurs. So that's all he knows. Until we're in the ground No, they don't pick us up Instead they knock us down And that's the way it goes Until we're in the ground No, they don't pick us up Instead they knock us down And that's the way it goes Until we're in the ground I don't want to do this anymore No, I just want to say hell no So this is the probiotic that we bought. Did we buy them? So we bought a three month supply so that they will both use it this month. And then there will be one month supply left. And next time we'll buy a little tiny one like that and we'll have two doses left. So it was the cheapest way to go. Fiona thought it out for us. We are switching um, Storm over to this food. We decided to do it. We were just doing it super slow. And this is the probiotic for Fiona's horses. Isn't that crazy? It's huge. Can you believe she cantered poles? No. I know. Everybody thought Sophia was joking. She said, I want to jump. I, I'm ready to jump. And we all were like, yeah, okay, whatever. Because, I mean, she's still little and she's a little bit scared. But ever since she took over Sabrina, something got lit in her. And, and she wants to jump. Sophia, you're working on jumping, aren't you? Yeah. Sabrina already gave me a little jump. Yeah, that was a little jump. How did it feel? Bouncy. <laughs> Were you scared? No. And a big, huge spook. Yeah, she did a massive spook. And how did that make you feel? Almost fell off. Did you feel okay? Yeah. You were on fire tonight, Sophie. And the best part is, I did a jump. <laughs> it was kind of a jump. And are you ready? No, it was a way too big. It was bigger than what you thought it was going to be? I'm not sure if Sabrina just did a little hop right now. I think it was because Sabrina was dying to jump. So Sophie thinks that she did her very first jump because... No, second first jump. Because Sabrina did a little jump over the trap pole while she was cantering, which kind of counts if you ask me.
and don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.